Hello everybody, welcome to Let's Play RimWorld 1.0. I'm your host, Amulius. Well, last episode, we drawn out the plans for uh, well, what our settlement is going to look like. So let me first remove all the things that we don't want our guys to focus on. Yeah, very good. And... Alright, and go! few hours of burst e each day otherwise they're gonna go crazy really fast so it looks like uh, the, the warehouse is almost done already that's very good okay so they're, they're gonna build uh, the, the roof now in the meantime we can draw out draw out the first of the houses I'm not going to focus on flooring just yet, because that's going to take up resources that we uh, kind of need elsewhere. Hold on, let me check if I put everyone on. Currently, we need everyone to focus on everything. Except hunting, we're going to leave that out. Uh, oh, art's also not really a priority. Crafting is not a priority. And we can't really research anything yet, so... Alright! Hopefully we can get one of these buildings done as well. Not quite sure if we can do that in time. Yeah, but it looks a bit... Yeah. Very good. It's gonna be night time soon though, so they're... Yeah, they're not gonna build the second one in time. For nightfall. Let's uh, put down some sleeping spots. First night they're all gonna sleep in the same shed. I mean, they're not gonna like it, and I really don't care. They're not really in the uh, spot to be picky. But the second house is done, though. These trees are really in the way. We're gonna remove those as well, even if they're not fully grown yet. I think you get more resources if stuff is fully grown. But yeah, we're not gonna have that stuff be uh, blocking us this entire time just because it's not fully grown yet. So now well, they are gonna have a penalty because they're uh, s sleeping together in the barracks. And it's cold, and they're sleeping on the ground, and etc. etc. But uh, that's not going to be an issue because we are removing these things, and we're going to build down bed, put down beds. The beds there are going to give them a lot better sleep. And they're gonna give them a better uh, night's rest as well. Don't know what the quality is. Yeah, I expected as much. Awful. That's to expect. Expected. Uh, we just started the game, so the uh, overall crafting uh, quality is uh, is gonna be terrible. But at the very least, we have uh, free house. They have houses now, even though it's just uh, a shack and there is grass and dirt on the ground. They don't like that. They don't like that at all, and I can sympathize, but that's not really... we got bigger problems at the moment. So this is going to be the rec room. Actually, 
actually. That'd be fun. Considering this is going to be uh, adjacent to the uh, cooling area, it might be a good idea to have a uh, door in interlocking these two. Well, we are having kind of construction botch to happen a few times. That's because our guys are unskilled in uh, what they're doing. But well, we need these things to happen fast, so occasionally uh, construction being botched is, is fine. Now this, the rec room is going to be done soon. It is five, okay. But it was uh, smaller. Okay. Why is Tanya constantly at the edge of being broken? Yeah, this is still from last night. It's dark outside. Yeah. She's in minor pain. I guess that's because she had a. Uh, yeah, okay. Those give her minor pain. That's fine. Slept on the ground, yeah, you're gonna have a bed. Slept in the cold, yeah, that we're not gonna be able to solve that anytime soon, you're uncomfortable. Yeah, that's because you slept on the ground and stuff, and ate without a table. Yeah, we're also gonna fix that soon, so. Should be fine, okay, so. Install some doors. Yeah, that's fine. Unfortunately, we're also gonna have to start the uh, the shack over here, where they're gonna get the uh, complete this today. I want them to complete it tomorrow and then we're gonna turn this into a refrigerated area. Then we can also build the uh, let's see. Actually we might want to build a door here as well. So when they're done cooking they can instantly bring it to the kitchen. Oh wait I know where they're not doing any recreational stuff. I haven't given them any recreational things to do yet. So let's see. Let's also build a campfire, which is also a social spot. Oh, wait. Let's build it like so, so they're not uh, bothering each other. Yeah, this early on we don't need defenses. Okay, just a random uh, person uh, walking by. Okay, 
so we're gonna be making corn and potatoes and what else? Cotton. Let's put a wall down there as well. So for power, we want wood fill generators. Because we're gonna increase the uh, quality of living for our people. Temperature and coolers. Our guys are good at building so far. Aside from all the things that they're watching. They started sewing as well. Okay, they're all sewing now, very good. Okay. electrical machinery so that's really bloody useful okay i want to give this settlement the name new hope um, just gotta think of a new name for the faction Not really a republic, but uh, who cares? Dining chair. Got enough uh, steel to uh, power it, or is the grid uh, finished? Oh wait, it is finished. It's just that the generators are not uh, bad power, so they're not producing any energy. Also, we're starting to run out of resources. So, the cooling area is, uh, is powered, at least for a few days. So, um, let's see. 
this is going to be the cooking area and this is going to be the butcher area. So, butcher table. Let's make a fuel stove for now. Because uh, I think uh, having it powered by electricity is going to be a, a big problem. is going to hurt our, uh, our settlers. We can't really have that. Nice. Not so fast, Mr. Raccoon. Your table, uh, hold on. I've noticed a few things that I uh, didn't uh, pick up on until it was a little bit too late in my previous playthrough. If you make sure that the, uh, the areas are well lit and heated, the production goes up. So that's really beneficial for everybody. That said, I think we are out of steel. So let me quickly check if there's anything still left on the, on the map. Okay, so we got about 300? Question mark? Of the stuff lying around that we can pick up next morning. Once you're done that, oh. yeah, once you're done, oh, and after that, you're going to hold that. It is going to be a pretty big settlement, though. We'll say that. Okay, so our, our crops are growing. I 
think we also want to start on the uh, fourth house it's soon, considering we're probably gonna get attacked soon by uh, well, somebody. It always happens early on in the game. Oh, it falls under. Oh, we're missing wood for the butcher, butcher table. Okay, so I think we're gonna have to go down a, a bit more trees. Most of these trees are not fully grown yet. Okay. That's fair. Who made the good one? Can we tell? No. What does Kibble do? Oh, that's for animals. Tell so what it eats. Oh, it can also eat kibble. So maybe we make some kibble for uh, for our pet, so it doesn't eat our own food. I think we can actually make some uh, grove zones over here as well. We're not building that wall anytime soon anyway. Let's see if we can get some more corn uh, going. Corn gives you a lot of food. And some more cotton, so we can actually start making clothes soon. Hmm. 
So we're gonna have to start uh, hunting soon. I think it's about time we uh, address this. not gonna be a cook he's gonna get so many people food poisoning I mean before skill we're all probably still gonna get food poisoning but uh, hopefully less than uh, what demo would give us oh we're being attacked by a guy with a knife there's a blood loss bloody first and a bro holy crap we don't want him to get close I forgot to check if he's gonna prepare first or actively attack us right off the bat, but mm. no, he's gonna prepare first. Okay, I'm gonna make people uh, continue doing what they're doing as long as possible. Crap! I forgot to put down a bed here. If we don't put down a bed, we can't turn it into a prison. And we'll really need to recruit this guy. Because we need to help as much help as we can early on in the game. He's in paper of caring or social, that's that's fine. That's fine. He's good with animals, crafting and insanely good with melee. Which is going to make this guy a big ass threat if we don't kill him soon. Yeah, he's attacking, okay. Oh, there is. Oh, great, he's dead. Oh, he yeah, destroyed his heart. Yeah, okay. Her heart. That's that's gonna be bad for the bad for the elf. Okay. Uh, okay, so where do we make our cemetery? Oh, you know, there's tons of packed survival meats here. You know, this might be a good spot. At least give these people a decent barrel, even if they're, you know, attacking us. So that was one of the problems that I had in the uh, test uh, test run for uh, what do you call it? Uh, to, to, to see how the game worked again. Uh, the first one I managed to disable and capture, and the six after that I all killed. I, I tried to capture them, I just kept killing them, so my uh, settlement wouldn't grow, and that was a real big problem. Yeah, it's probably because he's very hungry. Yeah. 
this guy is sort of out of the way. He's currently being fertilizer for our plants. So, so the temperature here is good. Well, temperature here is insanely high, but that's because there's basically two ovens here. Temperature in the bedrooms are good. Okay. Did you just feel the love here? Ah, oh, he's been rubbed up above them. Oh. Okay, I'm so I was wondering why we were not cooking anything, and I forgot to add uh, bills for them to actually, you know, <coughs> start cooking. Oops. Refueling the so there's plenty of trees that we can cut, that's good. I just realized that I forgot something in, while designing my settlement. I don't have a hospital. Okay. But that doesn't have to be a problem. But it can be. It can be. Realize something else as well. Putting chairs at your workstations improves productivity. That said. I'm gonna make a stun cutter's table. No, wait. Here, building that here is not gonna be a good idea because we don't got a uh, spot where we house our uh, resources yet. And actually, I think we can have another growing zone here. We can. Let's see what we can. Uh, I don't know how high our growing is. Four, five, six. Okay, so six is the highest that we can make. Yeah, let's not make that. Let's make more corn plants. We should be able to harvest that uh, before winter comes, even if we build it a little bit late. We got plenty of plants. And Actually, building a growing zone is also one of the things I forgot while testing. So I only started doing that while it was already summer and probably already way too late. Okay, um, I do want to make a few things though. We got almost 700 wood, so we're gonna make some wooden floors. I do want to start on. Uh, Stone working soon though. So I just have to think about where I'm gonna put all the. Uh, basically, you have to put down a, a dumping stockpile zone for all the, these things so you can uh, turn them into stone. And if they're. Say, uh, previously I had it in this area and I built the, 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 the stone shop right next to it, and that was fine. 
but then they had to haul all of the stones back to the towards this stockpile and that doesn't work that really slows down uh, your progress so that didn't really work out what I'm thinking is we build a stockpile right here and that way they just have to walk this distance and then back towards the stockpile and that that is fine so there we go two doors here let's build a floor That's gonna keep them, uh, give them plenty of work to do. Oh god, I am very talkative. <laughs> Okay, Jane at least, you know, doesn't hate him. I think only Tanya hates him. Ugh. The penalty to fail to romance is pretty damn high. Let's have a huge uh, stockpile here. There we go. Spaceship deconstructed near a crash nearby. I think we can also destruct this one. This one was from our original ship. Not sure, quite sure what resources you get out of it. Should still be unofficial. No, 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 we, we don't care about that. Okay. Only things we care about are chunks. Stone blocks. No wait, not stone blocks. Those are gonna go here. So just stone blocks, just these things. Let's uh, get a uh, slate or granite. Let's see what we have more of. Granite. We also have marble. But Okay, so granite, granite. Or, well, oh, 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 no, no, no. these tiles, they uh, add beauty, they take a long while to uh, 
put on a Grando. Uh, flagstones are not beautiful, but they, they make good roads. Concrete is ugly, but are very good roads. Paved tile, cheap and quick to move around by neutral. Oh, neutral is, is not bad, but it takes up steel, so we don't really want that. Yeah, and the big down downside of wooden floors is that it's flammable. I think it's neutral in appearance. I wait, check, like, I can just check that. The minus 15 is dirt. So wooden floor is uh, neutral in appearance. That's fine. I think over here we want to put down concrete on the floor. There we go. That way we can move around uh, here faster. And it's a warehouse, so you know. Kind of burn through our resources quickly by building these floors, but that's fine. Just hauling away everything that's near our settlement. Because it's giving us a penalty to beauty. As well as slowing us down, and we don't want that. I did notice though that no one's hunting. Oh, crap. That's why no one's hunting. Oops. Yeah, there we go. Oh, first shot, nice. And there we go, we're now we're also butchering. Very good. E even though he has a low uh, Initial skill, because of careful shooter, he is pretty damn accurate still. Actually, I just realized that was the, the last day of the first week. So, let's take a look at what progress we have so far, shall we? built four shacks for sleeping and three of ours and four of us hopefully for the the, the first captive but uh, yeah we kind of killed him so uh, that party didn't really last uh, we got ourselves a kitchen a butcher shop a uh, recreational area and a refrigerator all in one building well sort of one building we got ourselves a warehouse uh, and a stone cutter and a uh, Sculptor's uh, table, respectively. Might be worthwhile to put a tool cabinet down there. A bit costly, but should be able to make that work. We also should put down some chairs, so uh, the ones working at them are a bit more comfortable. Let's quickly do that. There we go. Uh, yeah. We planted a lot of uh, plants to, uh, that we're gonna be able to, to harvest to uh, increase our uh, food uh, food supply. And we started working uh, on getting some, some uh, leather and stuff like that. So as soon as we get someone who's capable of crafting clothes, that we can actually do that. I want to thank everybody for tuning in. I missed the movies, and I'll see you guys next time.